Previously on Totally Tedly. So we were putting together Jessica's music video. Uh, uh, uh. Now Jessica, she was the hero of the music video. Careful with the hand. Careful with the hand. Joey was a whiny little bitch the whole time. Did you go to college? I don't know what I wanted to do. I just wanted to smack him just to try to get him to see Tedly's vision. It's trailer and it's early Monday morning before I have to go to work. Jessica decided to make a vlog about her feelings about her possibly moving. I applied to Tennessee State University in Nashville. And she's thinking more and more about moving. It's kind of scary because it would be just me. It's a delicious world and you're just living in it. to go to court for the first time. It is scary as fuck. Earlier this year, I went to jail. So at the end of the night, I just was really drunk and I ended up in jail. I went to jail for being drunk and disorderly. They locked me up and threw away the key. So now, after that happened, what they do is they decide what they go and charge you, and so then you find out what they're taking you to court for. Then they press the charges. Oh my gosh, this whole going to court stuff? I never in my life imagined I would have to do this. Going in there, that courtroom, knowing that I might go to jail? They don't look at you like a regular person in court. They look at you as this criminal that should go to jail and be punished. Oh. There was no defense. I was completely guilty. So, Ted. The damn court. Yeah. You want to know about it? Yeah. What, what's with you in the court? So, Jessica was asking me, so I got my continuance. So, I did manage in my first court appearance to get a continuance. Fuck this. Like, I'm just over it. So, why did you get a continuance? He kind of just blurts out that he got a two week continuance. How the hell do you get a continuance? <laughs> I don't know how the court systems work because that's not my area of expertise. So I was telling Jessica about my continuance, meaning I can get a lawyer in a few more weeks so hopefully I won't be completely screwed over trying to defend myself in court. But so I can get my uncle to be my lawyer so I don't have to like worry about paying for a lawyer. Okay. But he got a continuance. My uncle can be my lawyer. Oh and that's awesome. Yes. So it will be free and Cause you got some bills to I pay. got some Beyonce bills up in here. Wow. You know, your girl. I know my girl. Now going to court was a nerve wracking experience. It wasn't sexy at all. At least that's out of the way. So now it's just a waiting game to see what happens. See if I have to go to prison. But even the thought about going to prison scares the shit out of me. Can you? Oh, no, like, I don't even want to think about that. One day in the jail was bad enough. Like you I don't. I can't even imagine. So, okay, but so that's my court shit. How is your vlog going? Oh, my vlog is going great! I asked Jessica how her vlog was going. It's, it's going good. He gave me some great advice on what I need to do to up my view level. And he gave me some great advice. How to work the title, how to work the tagging, just so I can get more views. So, I can make a this. I just put that to use and we'll just go from there and see how it goes. I'm so glad that Jessica is now my YouTube BFF. How is it going? So I picked Bruza up from his apartment. Not too bad. Looks like he just woke up. He went back with me to my place and we hung out with Cam. It's nice to be in your house, man. You have the nicest house anyone I know. It's, it's awesome that you finally let me inside and not just on the sidewalk. I know it was <laughs> it was honestly a stretch, as we all know. I was letting them all know my plans and things that I had laid out to do. I have a lot of exciting things to tell you guys. First of all is when Strayler was here at my house, I got a phone call from another reality TV show. I had to tell them that I was auditioning for a TV show. Very cool, so tell me a little bit about yourself. I got a call from a casting agent right there when Jessica was there. I love that you did it on your own. I work on the biggest loser when I hear a success story. Oh. You're on your own, I've always been proud. Congratulations, that's awesome. 
Ooh, so I might have, um, it's called The Fierce Competitor this time. The show that I got the phone call for is called The Fierce Competitor. And basically what it's about is... Um, competing fiercely. Yes, competing fiercely. <laughs> Mental, physical challenges, but you know what? It's $100,000 if you win. So I'm hoping to get that one. Go Tedley! Yes, Team Tedley! I might Ooh. finally get a budget! All the Skype auditions that have happened since that phone call have gone fantastically. And so <laughs> that's not the only thing I've been working on. I've been working on new music. I'm working on new music. I am halfway through a new album, girl. Um, Ooh, your music's so good. Oh, thank you, thank you, girl. I wanted them to know everything was going so well for me. That's awesome. But so I've also been stretching, like me and Bruiser have been discussing a lot of his projects. He's gonna take on some of his own projects. Bruiser is starting to work on his own cartoons. Yeah, Exciting. Bruiser's doing his own stuff now, I'm excited. I'm excited that he's branching off from my company to do his own thing. Because if Bruiser does well and he also works with me and I do well and I work with him, it's just gonna expand what we do. And also I've been getting Strayler in on the vlogging, so she's starting a Video Gamer Girl vlog. And I'm so excited to let them know. Headley's <laughs> Troublemakers. I like that, the whole Troublemakers. It was at this time that I also figured out I needed to call my fans Troublemakers. <laughs> That's what I call my fans now, as my Troublemakers. Justin Bieber's got them believers. We've got Troublemakers. Yeah, Justin All Bieber's right. got believers. Lady Gaga's got monsters. Kesha's got animals. Well, Tedley, Tedley's Kesha's got... Kesha's really stuff is called animals? Yes. Team Tedley causes trouble, so we are Troublemakers. Well, Tedley's is called Troublemakers, and that's fitting, right? Well, it's better than animals. Yeah. It is kind of, because I am a homeless kid, but I do tend to steal a lot. Are you okay? Well, that's not good. So then I went to hang out with Bruiser some more at his place. Anyway, here, I have pee on the sudden. It's the uh, brown square one. You know, I told Bruiser that apartment was wonderful, but the truth is, it was a piece of shit. So right now, I am inside the apartment of a homeless man. Now, Bruiser's apartment on a scale of 1 to 10. Um, look at this bed. I just don't even know. When I think of Bruce's apartment, I think of the slums. Bruce's apartment was completely nasty. There was shit on the floor, it was a damn mess, it was disgusting. I was showing my audience the, uh, the glory that is my hole. I just brought Bruiser to the liquor store so he could get his liquor. I thought, why not help the homeless and bring him to get some food? and liquor. I might actually uh, do the pub crawl. And no. if everybody else gets to walk around with booze tonight, I don't see why I can't. I win again. I'm gonna get a call from jail. I got pulled over again.